Let's talk about the top four machine learning certifications that are going to help you become a machine learning engineer. You can even call it a roadmap to follow because I believe that in three to six months, you're going to catch up to the industry if you put in the work. But before we dive in, let's clarify a confusion that some of you may have. And this is the difference between Coursera certificates and Coursera certifications. Because certificates are awarded when you complete a specific course of study. And this shows that you receive training in a particular field. While certifications, on the other hand, are given when you pass a specific exam and that indicates expertise in a subject. While both of them can help you stand out when applying for a job, I definitely believe that certifications are what you need to get. You need to take those exams at the end so you can show that you have those skills, that you didn't just browse through the content. And to be fair, like many exams are super easy anyway nowadays, but it's the best option that we currently have to show off our dedication. Because certificates don't really cut it anymore, because anybody can just skim through the content. You need to test out those skills and you need to show your result. Now having cleared this out, I think the first certification on the list is my personal favorite, and this is Andrew Ng's Machine Learning Specialization. And this three-core specialization is designed to help you master the fundamental machine learning concept that you need in order to develop practical machine learning skills, you know, like building and training models. And this course is offered by Stanford and Deep Learning AI, and to be honest, it's the best introduction that you can have to the field. Next, we have the IBM Machine Learning Professional Certificate. And this is a six-course program that goes through practical machine learning skills like supervised learning, unsupervised learning, and deep learning. It also includes a capstone project where you build recommender systems. And I say that this is great for beginners and intermediate users. Next up, we have the machine learning specialization from the University of Washington. And this is a four course program that covers the major areas of machine learning. And that includes prediction, classification, clustering, and of course, many other topics. This certification is also recommended for those of you that have an intermediate knowledge of the field, and you must have some related experience as well. And I say that you need to choose between the IBM one and the University of Washington one after you went through Andrew Ng's machine learning specialization, because once you have taken two of these three uh, certifications, I believe that you can start prepping for a professional certification from a cloud provider like Google Cloud, AWS, or Azure. And in order to earn a professional certification, you must usually pass a one and a half hours or two hour exam, depending on the cloud provider. I definitely recommend that you go for the GCP Professional Machine Learning Engineer Certification because Google Cloud has some of the best courses. And I definitely like the complexity of the questions in the exam because they really care about uh, you being prepared. In order to prepare for it, you can take the nine course series on Coursera. And to be honest, all of these are great. And Google really split the learning material properly. So by the time you're going to take the exam, you're going to be very, very well prepared. Because no matter where you are on your machine learning journey, building from a beginner level, you know, to passing those machine learning exams, I definitely believe that this four certification roadmap will get you job ready in three to six months from now. And you can complement your learning as well by using ChatGPT. And you can refine those concepts clearly in your head so you don't just skim through the topics in the courses without understanding things at a deeper level. Keep in mind that the path to learning machine learning isn't about collecting certifications. It's about continuous learning and applying your knowledge. And once you go through these certifications, believe in yourself, right? Believe in yourself and work on personal projects in the meantime in order to solidify that learning because you're going to be interview ready in no time. I believe that it's easier than ever now to get started and be ready for machine learning interviews. And if you found this video helpful, please give it a like and subscribe to my channel for more content like this. Let me know what certifications you're considering or if there are any others that you took and you enjoyed taking. Until then, I'll see you in the next one.